In this video, we will solve a problem on optimization. The question is given utility function u is equal to x y square. U denotes the utility x and y are the two goods. Price of good x is 2 and price of good y is 3. Total income of the consumer is 9. We have to find out the optimal quantities consumed of the two goods. Okay. So the question is we want to maximize this utility of the consumer subject to its budget constraint okay so we want to maximize utility of a consumer which is derived from the consumption of good x and y subject to the budget constraint what will be the bu budget constraint simple thing price of good x times units of good x plus price of good y times units of good y should be equal to its income that means e uh, income should be exhausted on the two goods okay so price of x is being given as 2 I have written here into x plus price of good y is 3 that's 3 y is equal to income of the consumer is 9 I have written here 9 now first order condition for optimization requires that marginal rate of substitution between two goods x and y should be equal to their price ratio okay graphically it simply means if I can draw the graph here so the graph will look like this let us say we have units of good x on the horizontal axis units of good y on vertical axis okay so we are being given the budget constraint this 2x plus 3y is equal to 9 let us say this is our budget constraint first order condition requires that the marginal rate of substitution between two goods should be equal to the ratio of the prices so uh, let us draw the indifference curve also here okay so let us say this is our indifference curve this mrs means simply the slope of indifference curve okay slope of indifference curve is our mrs mrs and it should be equal to the slope of the budget line what we call the ratio of the price okay it should be equal to the ratio of the price px upon py and graphically it means uh, the point where our budget constraint or budget line is tangent to the indifference curve corresponding to that uh, point we will have the optimal quantities of the two goods okay so marginal rate of substitution is equal to simply the marginal utility of good x upon marginal utility of good y should be equal to price of x upon price of y now this marginal utility of good x means simply the partial derivative of our utility function with respect to x if we take the partial derivative of this function with respect to x derivative of x is 1 so we are left with y square here okay similarly uh, du upon dy means the marginal utility of good y okay so this will come out to be if we take the derivative of this function with respect to y so this uh, derivative of y square will be 2y so we will get 2x y it should be equal to the ratio of the prices that means price of good x is 3 sorry 2 price of good y is 3 so this is equal to 2 upon 3 then we have we can cancel one y here we are left with uh, y upon 2x should be equal to 2 upon 3 solving for y okay so we have multiplying this uh, 3y is equal to 4x that means y is equal to 4x transposing this, this 3 here we get 4x upon 3 okay now what we need to do we got the y is equal to this uh, stuff here we need to plug this uh, value into the budget constraint okay when we put the value of y into the budget constraint we get 2x as it is plus 3 in place of y we write this value of y should be equal to uh, 9 so 2x plus this 3 and 3 will get cancelled we are left with 4x here so 2x plus 4x is 9 that means 6x is equal to 9 which gives us x is equal to 9 upon 6 which is 3 upon 2 that means optimal quantity of good x is equal to 3 upon 2 3 upon 2 okay now again we need to put the value of x is equal to 3 upon 2 either into our budget constraint or we can put simply in this where y is equal to uh, 4x upon 3 so i have just plugged the optimal value of x is equal to 3 upon 2 in this equation you can put it uh, back into the budget constraint or in this equation so it is your discretion here okay so y will be equal to i have solve for y here so y will be equal to 4 the optimal value of x is 3 upon 2 so in place of x i have written 3 upon 2 upon 3 
so two ones are two to the four so two to the two three are six we get six upon three here which gives us y is equal to two that means optimal quantity of uh, good y will be two okay that's how do we find out the optimal uh, quantity is consumed by two they sorry consumed by the consumer that he will consume two units of good y and three upon two units of good x that means 1.5 units of good x i hope i make myself clear thank you